स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज एन सी आर टी प्रॉब्लम एट पॉइंट वन फ्रॉम पेज नंबर टू फिफ्टी सिक्स ऑफ रिडॉक्स रिएक्शन राइट सो लेट्स रीड दिस स्टेटमेंट इन द रिएक्शन गिवन बिलो आइडेंटिफाई दी स्पीसीज अंडर गोइंग ऑक्सीडेशन एंड रिडक्शन ओके सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन यू आर हैविंग थ्री प्रॉब्लम एंड यू हैव टू फाइंड द स्पीसीज हु आर अंडर गोइंग ऑक्सीडेशन एंड रिडक्शन राइट सो लेट्स राइट दी फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम दैट इज एच टू एस हाइड्रोजन सल्फाइड प्लस क्लोरीन गिव राइज टू एच सी एल हाइड्रोजन क्लोराइड प्लस सल्फर राइट सो इफ यू सी द एलिमेंट्स इन दियर मॉलिकुलर स्टेट और अटोमिक स्टेट ऑलवेज हैव जीरो ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट राइट सो डेफिनेटली क्लोरीन इज इन इट्स मॉलिकुलर स्टेट एंड सल्फर इज इन इट्स अटोमिक स्टेट सो बोथ विल हैव जीरो ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट राइट नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल फाइंड द ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट ऑफ सल्फर इन एच टू एस नाउ इफ यू सी द इलेक्ट्रोनेगेटिविटी ऑफ हाइड्रोजन इज लेस देन सल्फर राइट सो डेफिनेटली इट विल हैव इट्स ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट एज प्लस वन राइट नाउ वी विल फाइंड द ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट ऑफ सल्फर सो प्लस वन देर आर टू एटम्स ऑफ हाइड्रोजन सो इन टू टू plus x overall charge on h2s is zero so i'll mention zero over here right so 1 into 2 for sure it will be 1 plus x equal to 0 x equal to plus 2 when i'll take it on the other side it will be minus 2 right so the oxidation state of sulfur in h2s is minus 2 right now let's find the oxidation state of chlorine in hcl i know that the electronegativity of chlorine is higher than hydrogen so hydrogen will have its oxidation state as plus 1 right i'll mention x over here so plus 1 plus x overall charge i am having zero right so i'll write zero over here so x equal to plus 1 on the left side of the equal to when i'll take this value on the other side it will change its sign that means the oxidation state of chlorine is minus 1 in this case h2s this sulfur is having minus 2 oxidation state but on the product side it is having zero oxidation state for sure h2s is oxidized h2s is oxidized because on the product side from sulfur i can say removal of hydrogen is happening right so you can write it is oxidized because a more electronegative element more electronegative element chlorine is added to hydrogen on the product side right addition of oxygen always cause oxidation and addition of hydrogen always cause reduction so you can write over here addition of oxygen will cause oxidation and addition of hydrogen will cause reduction right chlorine is having hydrogen on the product side so chlorine will be reduced right so i can say that chlorine is reduced due to the addition of hydrogen in it right now let's see the next problem so the next one is fe3o4 right and uh, there are three molecules of fe3o4 plus 8 al give rise to the 9 fe plus 
फोर ए एल टू ओ थ्री नाउ हियर वी विल अप्लाई द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ एडिशन ऑफ ऑक्सीजन राइट ऑन द रिएक्टेंट साइड आयरन इज हैविंग द ऑक्सीजन बट इन ऑन प्रोडक्ट साइड वी आर नॉट हैविंग ऑक्सीजन विद आयरन सो फॉर श्योर हियर रिमूवल ऑफ ऑक्सीजन इज हैपनिंग राइट सो रिमूवल ऑफ ऑक्सीजन it will cause the opposite of oxidation that means here reduction is happening in case of iron right now if you see aluminum now on the reactant side we are not having oxygen over here but on the product side there is addition of oxygen in aluminum so addition of oxygen mean we are having oxidation right so i can say that aluminum is oxidized whereas so you can mention the reason with it also so because oxygen is added to it right now on the other side ferrous ferric oxide now why am i calling it ferrous ferric oxide because in fe3o4 there are two oxidation states of iron right plus 2 and plus 3 that's why i am calling it as ferrous ferric oxide now in case of ferrous ferric oxide that is fe3o4 it is reduced because oxygen is removed from it right now let's see the third problem we are having 2 na plus h2 give rise to the nah twice right now i know it very well that the oxidation state of the elements in their atomic state or molecular state it is always zero right so the oxidation state of sodium will be zero as well as the oxidation state of hydrogen on the reactant side will be zero now i know that sodium is more electropositive than hydrogen for sure it will not change its oxidation state at any cost so the oxidation state of alkali metals are plus 1 only right i'll find the oxidation state of hydrogen so plus 1 plus x overall charge i am having zero so i'll mention zero over here right so x equal to plus 1 on the left side of the equal to when i'll take it on the other side it will change its sign that will be minus 1 so i'll mention minus 1 over here so if you see sodium is having 0 to plus 1 oxidation state right so if we are having plus positive oxidation state to zero oxidation state or to zero oxidation state to the negative oxidation state we will have reduction over here right if i am having negative oxidation state to the zero oxidation state or zero oxidation state to the positive oxidation state oxidation will happen over here right so in our case zero to plus 1 oxidation state we are having in case of sodium so in case of sodium we will have oxidation so sodium is oxidized over here right now if you see the oxidation state of i can say oxidation is happening over here right and uh, in case of hydrogen for sure zero to negative oxidation state is taking place right so in case of zero to negative oxidation state always a reduction is happening over here right so i can say that hydrogen is reduced in this case right 